We're with Ryan Karchner, the professional of the year from the Utah section in 2019. Ryan, did you ever see this day coming in, in your life? No, no, it's something, you know, I don't know if everyone plans on hopefully being a candidate for or a possibility of getting something like this, but no, this is, uh, this is really special. I'm way excited to be honored like this, for sure. How did you get involved in the golf business? Well, you know, I always played golf. I grew up at Glenmore, like many of the people that we know in, the, in, in our career. And, and um, you know, what happened is in college, I was trying to figure out what I was going to do. I was trying to play some basketball, but um, uh, they were opening up the old mill and I knew somebody that was running the place. You know, Devin was the, the pro up there, so I went and hit him up for a job while I was still going to the U, and, and then some doors open, and for some reason I stuck around. Do you miss hoops? I do miss hoops, yeah, I do. <laughs> well, I don't play anymore. That's Golf's right. a little safer, isn't it? It is. Give me some of the guys who you look towards as mentors. You know, there's there's a bunch of them. You know, I, I love, when I first got my head pro job at uh, Hidden Valley, I, I called on a bunch of guys, Eric Nelson, I went and sat down with Ronnie Branca, you know, the guys that, um, have, I felt like I've kind of been down the same road, kind of on the private side. And so there's a lot of those guys that I call and I still do call for some advice. You know, Craig Sarlo, some guys that I've known for a long time that, are, that have been awesome support and help, you know, just help me become who I am. Your job, I'm guessing, is kind of busy because you're running a couple of courses up there promontory. Right? Yeah, two courses and then somehow they keep us busy in the wintertime. I don't know how that's, that was part of the deal. I have to go back and negotiate that. But it's, it is, it's, it's really, really busy and it's been, it's been fun. It's definitely different from the first time I was at promontory, but it's, it's such a fantastic place and I really enjoy being there. What's the toughest part of your job right now? Um, trying to keep everybody happy at the same time. It's, it's always been, I think, a, a juggling act and trying to make sure that I'm covering all my bases and not leaving anything out. So when you do leave something out at a private club, usually you hear about it. So, but it's, um, it's been fun, especially with my calling here at the, at the section, through the section and stuff. It's been very rewarding, but it's, it can be fairly challenging on a day to day. Well, you must be doing a very good job at it. Ryan Karchner, the 2018 Professional of the Year from the Utah Section PGA. All right, Ryan, I'm gonna hit you with some rapid fire. Somebody start the clock. Favorite PGA Tour player? Um, this is not rapid fire. How about uh, Jack Nicklaus? Hamburgers or hot dogs? Hamburgers. Tiger or lefty? Lefty. Tiger. I prefer both. Good answer. Him Valley or Promontory? I prefer both. Promontory right now. Flag stick in or flag stick out? Flag stick out. Best pizza topping? Sausage. Highest golf score? Highest? Boy, in the 90s, I'm sure. Maybe more than that. Actually, when I started keeping track, it probably would be in the 90s. Worst golf shot at the most important time? Probably a top into the water, I'm sure, at some point in time in the Utah Open. That would be one of my most important golf shots. Those are the worst. <laughs> well, that was some fun. What do you think, Wesley? Do you have chocolate? Eggs. Yeah, it was way fun. Hey, you want some? That's a wrap.